Welcome back to EA Sports. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski getting set to call all the action here. The EA Sports crew is in place. The players are ready to go. What's the message here, Ray? I don't know that there can be a message other than it's so obvious. If you're the team in the lead, it's a chance to stretch the series. If you're the team behind, you got to close that gap. Critical game. We are about set to drop the puck as both centers make their way into the dot. A critical game for both sides here, and we are underway. Officials blowing the play dead. We've got a penalty on the way here. Well, the official's going to give him two minutes to think about that one. Yeah, you can argue for a few seconds, James, I guess, but you already know at this point you're going to sit down. The Aces get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. Hey, here's a power play, and the game is scoreless. What a nice opportunity for them to kick the other team in the shins a little bit, get the lead, and play from in front. Picks off the pass in the defensive zone. Trying to gain a step. He's in the clear. Denies him on the breakaway. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. The Renegades win it. Rips it and rips it. There's the whistle as the puck goes out of play. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. And he gains the zone here. Houston's got him along the wall. Puts it on net, and a beautiful stop by the glove. Offense his own face off, and he wins the draw. Hammers a shot off a stick. Phillips is slowed down with the hook, and the officials are calling for a delayed penalty. Pretty cut and dry from up here, and the officials saw it firsthand with hooking the call. It's a penalty of being in bad position, and I think when you impede a player like this, they should call the hooking penalty every time. A huge opportunity for the power play unit here. A five on three as we get set to drop the puck. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. There's really more strategy to a five on three than a five on four. Too many times the five on three guys just stand around and pass the puck around the outside. The aces will play the puck from behind the net. Carries it across the line. Slides it across. He's got a step. Move to the middle and can convert. He's not going to like to see that on the replay, James. He doesn't even get a shot on. Houston's going to play the puck from behind the cage. Milwaukee's got a hold of it against the wall and manages to clear the zone. The Aces have it behind the cage. Unable to reach that one. Takes the pass from the opposite point. And the penalty killing unit doing work. Excellent kills. We're both back to even strength. Hey, I think I killed two penalties in my life. Looked to me like the penalty killers did a good job there. They didn't really give up anything. But getting another look at that, man, did he take a big hit. Now he's got to go collect his bucket that popped off. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Lack's going to slow things down and up for the whistle. Oh, you got to kill the play eventually. That way everyone can get reorganized. Ronnie ties up his opponent. Houston's got it now. Sends it down low. Right out front. Blocker save. Wait, they're singling a goal. It, it, it looked like he had it, but it looks like they're singling a goal now. That's about as lucky 
heavy as you can get. You need some puck luck most of the time to win. There's a good chunk of it. The Aces are back at center ice and with it a 1-0 lead. You'd like to start quickly. This is about as perfectly as you can. At home, crowd behind you, and an early lead. Houston's got the puck along the boards. Takes the feed. And now he angles it across to Smith. And he was slowed up. Hooking looks to be the call as the official's arm goes up in the air. Let's get the official decision. This is a good old-fashioned hooking the call here. He looked like he was water skiing. Man, you got to move your feet. You get your stick around his waist, you'll get called. Another special teams opportunity for both sides as the man advantage unit is back to work again. Sometimes you have to have the shortest of memories when you play on a specialty unit like the power play. It hasn't gone very well for them so far tonight. They have to attack this power play with a renewed vigor. Sends the pass over. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Knocked away. Trying to clear. And the officials stop the play as that one goes into the bench. Houston's up here in the first, and they could easily be up by more based on what they've done offensively. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Gets in front of it. Still lots of time left here in this frame. one nothing is where we sit at this point. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Referee singling delayed penalty. Looks like hooking will be the call. There's the whistle. Let's get the official decision. I know he doesn't like the call on this one. Nobody does, but I think he has a case here, Ray. Well, it looked like the penalty was going to be called, and then it got sold even more so. So that's a hooking call that he doesn't really like. A big two-man advantage of five on three as the puck is set to be dropped. Guaranteed, James, the last thing the coach said to these guys coming out for the five on three is be urgent, be on the puck, be aggressive. Gets it out of his own end. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Comes up with the stop. I think he got a blocker on that one. Save made by the goalie. Lax had to be on his game. That's a great chance. And manages to clear the zone. The Aces have it behind the net. Carries it in. Moves the puck. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain. Houston still got time here in this first period to increase this lead. Morrison's won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. Can't get it to go. Gets it out of his own end. Houston's got it from behind the net. Tosses it on to Pajarvi. Pajarvi's going to play it against the half wall. Right in front of the net. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Both teams back to even strength. Really nice effort by the penalty killing unit on that one. Well, they'll have to regroup after that. The power play doesn't cash in. Opportunity lost for them. Puts it on net from the point, And too much traffic in front blocks that one. The Aces have had multiple scoring opportunities here in this first and could easily have a much bigger lead. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Let's it go from the back end. Makes a save. Cool and calm under pressure. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Pajarvi's gaining momentum. Gets the puck back onto his stick. Gives them nothing in front. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Houston's capitalized on their offensive abilities here in this first period. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. 
good hit on the play. Takes it across the blue line. Moves it around along the half wall. Puck lands back onto a stick. And he regains control of the puck. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Phillips. And I think he's seen enough as he stops the play by covering up the puck. Oh, guys are going to be bent over trying to gasp for breath. They'll be in favor of that move. Well past the midway mark of this period, we've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Handles the pass up to the middle of the ice. And not much on that one. The Aces have been the better team in this first period. More scoring opportunities and as a result, more goals. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Takes the feed at the point. And that puck leaves the zone. The Renegades have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Milwaukee's got a hold of it along the wall. Obstruction penalty coming up. Looks like a hook here. And he sprints to the bench to get the extra attacker out on the ice. Let's see the call here. A little too much stick and body hooking up on this one, hence hooking on the call. Yeah, I, I didn't think this was a difficult call for the official to make at all. Another chance here on the man advantage. The power play can be so frustrating when you get an opportunity and it doesn't go well. You start to press pretty quickly into it. Now's the time to relax, readjust, and attack again. Rocks him on the play and manages to clear the zone. Takes the bank feed. Here they come on the attack. Back at the point, they set it up. Moves it to Morrison. Slides that one right across the blue line. On the attack along the boards. Quick pass to Payarvi. Oh, what a stop! Gets it out of his own end. Houston's gained possession along the boards. Handles the puck. Here's a short pass to Smith. From in close! And he misses! Isn't that just a confidence thing? Confidence are trying to be too perfect. Get it on the net. That's the number one goal. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Moves the puck along the half wall. Back on a stick now. Smith's got it along the wing. Back to the point it goes. And that's wide of the net. Now he's going to have to adjust the sights on that one. That thing's off target by a long way. That's going to rattle your molars around there. That is an enormous hit that he took. The Aces have controlled this game here in the first period. More shots, more goals. Phillips has won the faceoff. Quick shot and puts it high. All right, goalie had to dock that thing with so high. First box swooping in on the attack. Sends a pass over. Through center along the wing. Less than a minute to go here in the opening frame. With possession along the wall. From point blank, denies him in front. Sometimes you're in close, there's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. Houston's got the lead here late in this first period. And a solid job tying up his opponent. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Here's an offensive chance. Slides it back to the blue line. Shot from the point. That won't go as that goes off the side of the net. And the offensive onslaught will come to an end as the clock runs out, bringing the period to a close. And while both teams get a refresher, we'll take one ourselves heading into the second period.
Welcome back, everyone. He's Ray. I'm James. Second period set to go. Here we go. Middle frame now underway as the puck drops. Well, this one underway. Ray, give us an update on what your assessment is to this point. Lots likely the only reason that they're still in this game. He was fantastic in a busy first period. The Aces have it in the offensive zone. Along the half wall with the puck. Penalty coming up here as the play is stopped. The good old-fashioned hook has sent him off to the box. He's almost in the right position, but he's got to give him a little hook. When he gives that tug, he goes to the penalty box. It gets called every time. And the man advantage unit goes right back to work. If you can find a way to get a power play goal here, you can change the momentum of this game. They haven't got one yet tonight. And you find yourself starting to press when you don't score. Nice pass. Houston's got a hold of the puck. Over the line they come. From one end of the blue line to the other. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Too much congestion in front. The Renegades take possession in the defensive end. And manages to clear the zone. The Aces will play the puck from behind the net. And they send it right back to him. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Blocked in front. And now he tries to get it across to Phillips. Comes up with a blocker save. Gets it out of his own end. Houston's got the puck along the wall. Both sides back to even strength. Slowly they start to take the momentum away from the other team. They get a power play and this PK unit has been perfect. They knock them down at the knees every time. Carries it across the line. Look out, a two-on-one. Great heads-up play in the defensive zone. Takes the feed. From the slot, fires away and makes the save. The Aces have put a lot of pucks on net and they continue to lead here early in the second. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Ref's arm goes up in the air. Looks like we got a hooking call coming up. And the goaltender gets to the bench for the extra attacker. Let's see what the official says here. Hooking the call and maybe a little sell job along the way. A little bit, but the player's got to move his feet. As soon as you stop, if it's even close, you're going to get down. They'll go back to work on their special teams. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. And manages to clear the zone. Let's it go with the stop. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. We got a 1-0 game to this point. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Puck grabbed by Payarvi. Centering pass. Fantastic save. Gets it out of his own end. Houston's got a hold of it against the wall. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Quick feed to Morrison. And now it's grabbed by Morrison. Here's a shot. Blocker save. Trying to clear. Finally, Ray. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. Play blown dead. Penalty coming up here. And he's off to the box for two for tripping. Not much of an argument there. A stick between the player's feet. Not a lot of time to work, but they still have a five on three. It's a short five on three, James, so the faceoff becomes even more critical. If you lose it, you chase it down the ice, and most of that five on three is gone. No room for that one to get through. And that's just out of reach. Tries to get it out of their own end. Cross the blue line, and they'll get that much needed change, Ray. Yeah, they've got to get guys off the ice. They look tired. Now you can get a fresh group on the ice. Carries it in. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. Tees it up from the back end. 
and that's blocked. Looking to knock it out of the zone. And clearing attempt is a big success on that play. Milwaukee's got the puck along the boards. Big play inside the defensive zone. The Aces gain possession in their own end. And a great job by the shorthanded unit those last few moments as the penalty expires. The pressure points on the penalty kill have been letter perfect tonight. They've pushed at the right times, they've sagged back at the right times, gotten the requisite saves when they need those two. Houston's message going into this one when we talked to them at the morning skate was to get a lot of pucks on net. They've done just that, and they lead as a result. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. Heads to the back of the net, and now he moves it to Wilson. Takes the pass from the boards. Wilson's playing it along the line. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Wilson's lugging the puck. Houston's ready to go on the attack. Slides the puck over. Up along the wing. Good hit to pump him off the puck. Receives the pass. Takes it across the blue line. Moves behind the net. Oh, James, that's close. I thought this was in. I thought the forward was going to be able to get to the post first, but he's not. That's a really strong save. No room right there. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Denied by the goaltender. High quality chance, high quality save. Centering pass. Flips it up the net, and that goes off a player. Haas brings it in. Shoots it, and that one's turned away. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. And they come up empty-handed. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Into the corner. Keeps a hold of it on the play. On the backhand. How do you miss that, Ray? I don't know, but we all do. You're right in the scoring zone, and you don't even test the goalie. Pass to Haas. Throws it on goal, and there's the save. Jens uses his skating skill to get into position to throw this huge hit. Here in the late goings of the period, 1-0 the score. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. The Renegades will play it in their own end and pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Moves it around along the half wall. Good battle along the boards for the puck. The Aces scoop it up along the boards. Makes his off the post. Milwaukee's only looking for something to go right. Get themselves back in this contest. But this hits the goal post, and the score remains unchanged. Handles the puck at the point. Takes a shot and makes a save. Slides it diagonally to Wilson. Here they come on the attack. Takes a shot, takes that one right in the logo. And we're gonna get a whistle here. This is so frustrating. You make a good shot, you beat the goaltender, and you don't get rewarded. It hits too much of the post and stays out. Houston's generated a lot of quality scoring chances, which is why they lead here late in the second. Takes it from the other side of the blue line. Into the corner now. Milwaukee's got a hold of it along the wall. Handles it along the blue line. Takes the pass. Here's a shot. Oh, comes up with a stop. Houston's up for good reason. They have been the more complete team offensively, which is why they lead late in the second. And nearing the final minute of the second. That's blocked. Referee signaling for a penalty. Looks like we got a hooking call coming up. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Over the line they come. And the puck stopper tags his man to get the extra attacker on the ice. Knocked away. Off target. Not really close with that. He got lots on it, but nowhere near the net. 
And that'll do it for period number two. One nothing is where we sit after 40 minutes of play. Still a wide open game. And we'll be right back for what should be a very intriguing third. The Aces will start the period with a full two-minute man advantage here. Houston's gained possession along the boards. And we got another stoppage in play for, guess what? Yeah, another penalty being called here. Hooking's the call. This is what yep. they kind of call the lazy penalty these days, yeah, right? It, but, it, but really, the problem is you're beat, and you panic, and you're trying to help. And the more you help, the worse it gets. Go sit down. And he certainly dug himself a hole there. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Trying to get the puck out of harm's way. And manages to clear the zone. Houston's got the puck along the wall. Now he takes it over the line. Drives it to the front of the net. Big save. Yeah, he gets out on top of the shooter. There's really nowhere for that puck to go. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. And manages to clear the zone. Houston's got it in their own zone. Ferguson's going to hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James. He needed a cover there. He had to be on top of his game to make that stop. That's a great scoring chance, and he turns it aside. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. one nothing is where we sit at this point. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Takes the feed. Right out front. Oh, pokes it away. Gutsy move, but it pays off. And that shot dies in traffic. Gets it out of his own end. Time running out on this power play. They've got one last chance here. Penalty has expired. Both sides back to even strength. Well, this has been a familiar script. Take a penalty, kill it off. The penalty killers have been perfect tonight. Carries it across the line. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Here's a blast, and that goes wide. The Aces have it against the wall. We got a penalty coming up here as the officials blow the play dead. And it's going to be two minutes for hooking on the call. A lot of people debate, is this a lazy penalty, the hook? I don't know if it's lazy all the time, but it's a penalty of being out of position. Your stick's parallel to the ice. You get called all the time. Another power play opportunity coming up here as they set up at the faceoff. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. It doesn't matter whether you've had one or ten power plays. The fundamentals of it are the same. Win the draw, get the puck to the point, try and spread the penalty killers out. Houston's got it behind the net. And they go back on the attack in the offensive zone. Misses a golden opportunity there. You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. Shot, and that sails over the net. He likes to go up there. Most times, that's maybe the only open area on the net. The Aces gain control of the puck against the wall. Here's a shot. Oh, just wide. Right in his wheelhouse, he powders it, but just misses. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. Potter's got it in the defensive end. There's the whistle. Offside is the call, stopping the play. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. We've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Penalty has expired. You've got to give the shorthanded unit a lot of credit there. Well, the penalty killers hang on. They give themselves a chance. They're not much time left, but they were able to stay in touch with the game with a good penalty kill. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Houston's attempt to put more pucks on net has paid off as they lead it in the third. 
And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. A chance in front with the backhand. Stopped by the goaltender. In tight, he had to make an excellent save. Takes that pass back at the point. Nice feed from the boards. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Houston's got the edge of the shot department, a big reason why they lead here in this third period. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Makes the save with the glove. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Sends the pass over. Pulls the puck at the line. On the attack along the boards. Finds some space in the corner. Quick feed down low. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Makes the save as he got a blocker on it. I like the way he tracks the puck here. He's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. The Aces have looked good tonight, especially offensively here in this third period. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Looks to set up at the point now. Comes up with a stop. Houston's got a hold of it against the wall. That's broken up in the neutral zone. Great pass from off the right side. From the neutral zone now. Lowers the boom with that hit. Moves the puck along the half wall. With possession along the wall. Moves the puck. Big time stop there. From the right side, takes the pass. Rocks him. Right up the gut, here they go. Carries it in. Handles the puck. Smith's got it in the offensive zone. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Sends a pass over. Along the half wall with the puck. And that one's broken up. There's the whistle stopping play. Penalty coming up here. First box going off for hooking. Well, when you stop your feet, you're almost advertising to the official to keep looking. There's the hook. As we're about to drop the puck, the power play unit back out onto the ice for another opportunity. Well, they get another chance here. They've earned the power play. They haven't got anything on their power plays yet. Haven't had a lot of them, but here's a nice chance for them. And manages to clear the zone. The Aces have it now. Carries the puck up through center. Move to the middle, and a stick in the lane ends that threat. Denied by the goaltender. Houston's been the better team tonight. They have turned good defense into solid offense, and they lead here in the third. Good job tangling up his opponent here. With the stop. There's another stop. He's right on it. Two consecutive saves. Tough ones at that. The Aces gain possession along the wall. Takes it across the blue line. Here's an opportunity to clear the zone. Big defensive play on that clear. Yeah, puck's got to get out, especially late. He does a nice job here. Slides the pass over to Phillips. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Well, you have to look at that as a blown opportunity for the power play here at this point in the game as both teams are back at even strength. And he comes up with it. Wow, that seems like a big miss, James. Critical moment in the game, and the power play laid flat for them. Tries to get it over to Potter. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Nice pass. Oh, what a save in front. Takes the feed. Grabs the puck at center. Looking to make something happen along the boards. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Pajarvi's got it across the line. Oh, what a stop! Gets it over to Wilson. Lugs the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. There's a shot, and that one's stopped. Ooh. 
Houston's been the better team offensively tonight. A lot of scoring chances, and they lead it late in this third period. Off the draw, and he ties up his opponent. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Here they come on the attack. Moves it around along the half wall. Grabs the puck here at the blue line. And sends it just out of reach. The Renegades move the puck in the defensive zone. Houston's got the puck along the boards. Hammers the shot. Oh, just wide of the net. It doesn't matter how close it is. If it's not on the net, it can't go in. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. The Aces have been the busier team in the shot department, and they lead it late in this third period. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Houston's got it in their own zone. That one sails to the bench, sending the coaching staff scrambling. The Aces aren't far from the finish line now as they lead it late in this third period. Jenks wins it in the dots. Puck picked up in the open ice. Puts it on net, and he makes the save. Houston's got control of the puck. Again, the denial by the goaltender. Yeah, he's pretty good positioning here, James. He makes the two stops back to back. Stop by the goaltender. Another stop by the goaltender. A critical draw here. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. The Aces take possession here in the open ice. Boone setting up against the wall. Shot on net, drops that puck tight to his chest. Houston's not far from the finish line here as they lead it late in this third. Puck is dropped, quick shot. And that's all she wrote on this one as we are in the books. Ray, you look why they're up in this series right now. Just look in the crease. You don't win many playoff series if your goaltender isn't the better goaltender. He's been excellent. He throws a shutout on the board here tonight. My name is James Sabalski, and on behalf of Ray Ferraro, thanks so much for hanging out with us. What an intense evening from this playoff atmosphere.